Faz, eight league games in. What's your take on the season so far? Um, I think you've seen a bit of everything this season. I think um, I think that um, we've uh, we've had some good games, some bad games, but end of the day, seven games in, we're learning. We're learning, and I think we're we're coming good. We're coming good. What are you learning? Oh, we're learning loads of things. Obviously, the manager, like like the manager said, we brought in quite a few new players, and we're all gelling. And like I said, we've got a really good team spirit here. Everyone's behind everyone, and the manager's putting his uh, putting his uh, method across and stuff. And I think in in a lot of the games, I think we're playing we're playing well, and you can see that. Do you know what I mean? But it will take a little bit of time. But I think we're starting to gel now. And like I said, the performance is always high, so I feel like the results will will come, will follow. Have the performances matched the results or not? In my opinion, no. I feel like if you have a look at a lot of the games and you break them down, uh, then um, we've performed pretty well throughout the games. We've had a lot of good chances and stuff. And I think, like the gaffer mentioned, it's been individual errors or a little bit of luck where they're costing us, but it doesn't last forever. That doesn't. And what about for you on an individual level? Saturday, 1-1 against Rochdale. Was that your best performance this season in a Stag shirt, Faz? Um, I don't know. I, d I, I don't look too much into that, if I'm being honest. It's end of the day, it's about the team. I know it's a little bit cliche, but my job is to defend. And obviously, we conceded the goal, so I'm not happy about that. And I thought we could have... Do you know what I mean? Kept a clean sheet, but like I said, we're working hard towards that and that will come. That will come if we keep going the way we're going. But uh, on a personal note, obviously, I'm always learning. I'm always learning and every, diff every, every other manager has a different method and you have to buy into that and you have to learn into it. So um, I'm learning, I'm enjoying my football and like you said, is it my best performance this season? I'll leave that to people to think about. I'll, I'll just concentrate on my job. Well, we thought you were excellent on Saturday. Uh, on a personal note, if I may, did you have an intention before the game to really revert to basics? Because what you seemed to do so well was very simple, but you did it to a, a fine standard of head it and kick it. <laughs> yeah, I think um, when you're going for a tough patch, like the whole team, we've uh, lost a couple in a row and it can nerves can creep in, a bit of uh, anxiety, any way you can say it. Uh, I think the best thing to do is to revert back to basics and do the basics right. Once you can do the basics right and you can build yourself into a game, then you can build the confidence and you can start trying other things. But I think Saturday was all about doing the basics, scrapping, fighting, working as hard as we've worked all season to try and get a result to stop the rot. Looking ahead now, Leighton Orient on Saturday, you come up against the division's second highest scorers and, and a man up the top whom you may well be marking, Harry Smith, who's uh, firing on all cylinders at this moment in time. I think he's the joint highest goal scorer in League Two. Tell us what you're preparing for and in particular against Harry Smith. Um, personally, I've never, I never really concentrate on the opponents too much. We concentrate on ourselves. I think that's the most important thing. Like a like I've said before, is if we play well, the rest will take care of itself. But now he's, he's obviously, I think I've played against him a couple of times before. He's a, he's a big lad and he's a handful. So we're going to have to be, the whole back four are going to have to be on, on a high alert when he's around. And um, yeah, I'll have to pay, pay special attention to him. But I think end of the day, if we get too muddled up about the opposition and stuff, we forget about our own game. And like I said, is we're building something here. We're trying to build something and it's about us. It's not about them. So, like I said, we have the utmost respect for them, but um, we're here, we're Mansfield, we do our thing, so we're going to go out there and we're going to play our football.